they members. Gonna me, they gonna send me a T-shirt on my back. <laughs> anyway, long as you're not the poster child. But see, Motown was such huge. It was you are right over there. <laughs> I'm sorry, Motown was a huge. <laughs> Y'all cut me off. I'm, I'm sorry. sorry. But anyway, Motown, uh, a generation before us, they in the '60s really changed music, not only yeah. uh, on the R&B chart, but uh, the pop chart. And I think yeah. they made uh, the pop chart more receptive to African-American artists. Uh -huh. well, and yes. uh, you look at all those artists, they were influential, but uh, I have to go with those uh, in the 70s. And then the 80s was a little different. I mean, we'd be here all day talking about You know things. that's the truth. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yeah. Okay, okay. And if you want to email us with any questions or comments, it's the Dayton Scene Radio Show at gmail.com. That's the Dayton Scene Radio Show at gmail.com. And by the way, you know I like funks in a swag. You we know, know you swag do. a goo, swag and a goo. We do too. Like it's like a collard green sandwich, black eyed peas with turnip greens uh -oh. to make a sandwich. He done messed it up that you time. Just made <laughs>